Uh, yes. Well, hey guys, it's me, Samar Brewer here, yet again giving you a new video. And basically, this thing's gonna be like a horror slash rant kind of thing, where basically is basically me giving like my opinion on what I think one of the biggest horrors there is in the world for people like me. And that is, I think, pretty much an acceptance. And basically it turns out that over in Australia there is, or like maybe it's finished, I don't know, Basically, there's this thing going on in Australia where they're basically like doing this postal vote thing or something in on like gay marriage, and basically the anti-gay adverts were like coming out and ended up um, watching this video where they were like, uh, these, like well, for me. And subscribe to a lot of different people, like Paul Frontal and Jacqueline Glenn and yada yada yada. And one of the YouTube channels I'm subscribed to is one that's basically like this gay couple. And I find their videos like really interesting and stuff. And basically, I watch their video, and it basically shows them reacting to this anti-gay marriage commercial and pretty much at the end of it they just tore the advert to shreds they like annihilated it into oblivion and basically when I saw the advert thing myself it was pretty bad I mean hey it basically comprised of three women who were basically like saying if gay marriage becomes legalized then teaching stuff like gay marriage and stuff will be compulsory and, and my schools told my son that it's perfectly okay for him to wear a dress to school. I mean, seriously, it's just ridiculous. When I heard the bit about, like, the mom saying that the school her kid was going to was, like, saying it was okay for her kid to wear a dress to school, well, basically that didn't make me immediately think that the mom's son was gay, it made me think of another kind of individual in the LGBT community. And that's you, I don't know. Transgenders, like me. Because the thing is, it's like, for me, whenever it comes to commercials and stuff from the LGBT community, and Basically, you hear about boys going to school in dresses. You don't exactly immediately think of someone who's gay. You think of someone who's transgender. Mainly like male to female transgender, such as myself. So, I'm not sure, but was the actor really trying to say that I don't know. I think it was either trying to say that being gay is the same as being transgender, or it was saying that everyone who's transgender is gay. I don't know. If it's either of those two things, then it is basically flat out wrong, because being gay is not the same as being transgender, in my mind, because, like, gay people, they're basically, like, somebody who is basically attracted to 
someone of their own gender, whereas transgenders are people who feel like they were born in the wrong body, like born the wrong gender. Kind of a bit different. Yeah. I'd say the biggest kind of thing that was annoying was pretty much the bit the advert said, where apparently countries which accept gay marriage, in countries that accept gay well, basically what the advert literally said was, in countries that accept gay marriage, Parents have lost the right to choose. I mean, seriously, what's it saying? That, like, in, people will be forced into a same-sex marriage? Or is it saying that, like, parents choosing who their children can fall in love with is A-OK? -okay? Mm. Oh, see, it's just ridiculous. And fortunately, though, in Australia, over there, the uh, majority of people are accepting of gay people and like gay marriage, it's only just the minority. It's just pretty much difficult to imagine or like, still comprehend that we're in 2017. And we still have people who think that, like, if you're transgender, then you're, like, a mentally unstable pedophile. Or that if you're gay, then you were, like, ill. Basically, like, there, I think, still are people around in this day and age. I mean, there are probably still a few people here and there over here in Scotland who are, uh, like, against things like transgenders having equal rights or gay people being allowed to get married. And, anyways, the thing is, if I remember correctly, when I did used to read the Bible a lot before I went right, I'm becoming an atheist while out. Basically, if God really does love everybody, then why exactly does he wind up preaching a whole mother load of hatred towards people who are like gay or transgender? And if you don't believe me on the Bible saying things that are like homophobic or transphobic, then basically like there'll be this thing which will show up thinking you to like one of the last videos I done which was on like sort of like a dainty style video for the first time. <sighs> well, anyway, please. Yeah, that's pretty much like done with this kind of rant then pretty much trying to have stuff to rant about. Well, that's it. Peace. So, for me, what I'm going to do next is I'm going to finish building this like, online model on Roblox. And so I'm like doing this plane thing which is like destroyable and stuff. Yet the only bit which is accessible is going to be the cabin. And anyways, I'm also going to go and basically like go and go browsing online through like Prime. Um, to see what kind of stuff I can get for my birthday shopping spree. Uh, on my birthday shopping spree. <sighs> I mean, I definitely think I could go over like a hundred quid easily when you come October. <sighs> and, well.
One other thing which I'm thinking of doing, if I just show you guys, it is basically me going to use a face mask. And for me, I think I'll either go for this one. Or I'm going to go for this one. Basically, I'm thinking it's going to be like something involving chocolate. Besides, I haven't had and like my mask in a pretty big amount of time. So, anyway, if you like this video, then, then you don't forget to give it a thumbs up, comment on whatever you like down below. I'm also thinking of maybe doing something like a poll thing for the video on whether you think that, like, gay marriage should be, like, legal or, like, Everything it shouldn't have it should be uh, like Adam and Eve, not Adam and Steve, you know, whatever, then you can go and do that. And if you want to, then feel free to subscribe to my YouTube channel and become part of my online family. And pretty much for me, I really do sort of consider like the people who like do subscribe to me and do give me loads of support online as like people who are part of like my family and stuff and they're all nice sort of like siblings from like siblings that I can choose or something that kind of thing so anyways before I go and ramble on anymore like I said like comment subscribe and Bye! <laughs> Yay!